Hey, Jordan, just uh, take us in that defensive huddle. I mean, you guys you got hurt, obviously. The, you know, the starting safeties were out. I mean, what do you say about the defense turning them away there at the end of the game? Oh, yeah, you know, uh, Mike Edwards coming to the game. He's a splash player, so uh, we wasn't really con too concerned with that. We know Mike's going to make plays. And then Andrew Adam, the veteran in the room, um, he's on uh, everything. He's on up to the – the speed, the playbook, mental notes every week. He uh, he doesn't get a lot of rest, but he's ready to be thrown in at any time. So uh, when you got D.Y. and Levante out there um, getting everybody's minds right and just setting the tempo. We'll go to Jeneline. Hey, Jordan, uh, congratulations, first of all. Um, Thank you. How difficult was it for you, you know, knowing that you weren't going to be back in the game with that shoulder injury and, and having to kind of watch that from the sideline. And also, um, have you heard anything as, as far as the severity of the injury? Uh, n nothing yet on it, but um, it's my shoulder just got on a hit. Uh, so we'll see more later on in a week. But uh, yeah, it was definitely uh, a big one for us. And uh, could you, re sorry, could you repeat the beginning of the question? Sorry, whoops. Sorry, um, just what it was like for you to to not be out there with your teammates the entire oh. game and having to watch them close it out without you. Oh yeah, it was it was hard to be on the sideline with you, but I know my brothers got my back. Um, you no, know, I just got out there and just tried to keep them energized and uh, just help them out a little bit. But I knew I knew when I was out, they was gonna step up and have my back. We'll go to Greg Allman. Jordan, you guys have, as a defense have gotten turnovers from teams that don't commit many turnovers. What, what do you think the key was to getting the pick, to getting the, 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 the takeaways that helped set this game in motion? Uh, I think really Sean um, Bunning started it the first playoff game uh, with getting, getting a pick and then kind of just set the tone in our DB room. And then he got one last week. And now everybody's like, you got to catch up to Sean. got to catch up to Sean. So uh, I think that coming into this game, we just had a confidence. Um, you know, coming off of last week, underdogs and just uh, being underdogs again, just put a chip on our shoulder. So uh, that's a big thing that we were working on all year is getting turnovers and uh, making it happen. We'll go to Scott Reynolds. We have time for a few more. We're going to talk about those two big forced fumbles, the last of which uh, Devin was able to, to scoop and almost score in. And, and mm -hmm. how are you feeling with two weeks off? You feel like like uh, you'll be ready for the Super Bowl? Oh, most definitely. Uh Super Bowl and once in a lifetime, whatever it takes and be back. Um, but yeah, you know, we just made a couple plays. I uh, got the, my ball on, got the ball out. Um, D. White was there to scoop it up. You know, last week he scooped one up too. So uh, just fly to the ball, which he always says, just fly to the ball, and good things will happen. We got a Julian Knight. Hey, Jordan, how surprised were you that they opted for a, a field goal there? And do you consider that the ultimate sign of respect for your defense? Oh, for sure. Um, no, we got a greatest quarterback on our team, and then we got a great defense um, on us too. So it's like you got to trust one another. Uh, we're playing lights out. Um, you just got to trust us to stop them, and um, you know, coaches put that trust on us, and we just uh, we're out there comb like playing as a team. And I think uh, this coming into the playoffs is one of the biggest things: is everybody co collectively playing together. Our last one will come from Kevin O'Donnell. Hey, Jordan, uh, congratulations. Um, can you kind of take us on to the sidelines? What was it like just being there and watching the final minutes of this game and seeing the Packers potentially driving uh, to, to tie this game up even if they got the two-pointer? Oh, uh, you know, there was still some time on the clock when they were driving down the field. Uh, but, you know, I always remember we had Tom at quarterback. So, um, you know, and another thing, our defense was going to stop them, um, hold them to three or score and stop the two-point conversion. So we still had a lot of a lot of hope for our team and never doubted them, not once. Um, got great leaders on this team and uh, just always re ready to step up for whatever is thrown at us. 